so today we'll discuss about the lipids the lipids the classification of the lipids the biomedical importance of the lipids or fat and the classification classification and the biomedical importance and the physiological role of fats we'll discuss about these three items so what is lipids lipids are the organic substances relatively insoluble in water and soluble in organic substances organic substances like alcohol ether etc are the organic substance chemically they are found they are starts of uh, chemically they are the starts of fatty acids and some alcohols and the classification now the classification of the lipids uh, these lipids are simple lipids starts of fatty acid with various alcohols they are fat and waxes fats what is fats fats starts of fatty acid with glycerol they are the starts of fatty acid with glycerol like wells are wells are fats in the liquid state and b waxes starts of fatty acids with higher molecular weight monohybrid monohydric monohydric alcohols monohydric alcohols now the complex lipids starts of fatty acids containing group groups in addition to an alcohol and and a fatty acids uh, complex lipids which are starts of fatty acid containing groups in addition to an alcohol and a and a fatty acids complex lipids are phospholipids glycolipids and other complex lipids what is phospholipids the phospholipids are lipids containing lipids containing in addition to fatty acids and an alcohol a phosphoric acid residue uh, residue they frequently have nitrogen containing bases and other substances like glycerophospholipid glycerophospholipid the alcohol is glycerol and the phosphophospholipids the alcohol is sphingosine sphingosine number b glycolipids glyco sphingolipids or glycosphingolipids glycolipids lipids containing a fatty acid sphingosine and carbohydrate lipids containing a fatty acid sphingosine and a hydrocarbon so other complex lipids are sulfolipids and amino lipids lipoproteins may also be placed in this category so the other complex lipids are lipids such as sulfolipids and amino lipids lipolipids lipoproteins may be also placed in this category now precursor and derived lipids there includes fatty acids glycerol steroids other alcohols fatty aldehyde ketone bodies hydrocarbons lipid soluble vitamins and hormones so procedures and derived lipids are there included you know, fatty acids glycerol steroids other alcohols fatty aldehydes ketone bodies hydrocarbons lipid soluble vitamins and hormones now the clinical significance of lipids the following diseases are associated with the abnormal chemistry or metabolism of lipids like obesity atherosclerosis diabetes mellitus hyperlipoproteinemia fatty liver lipid storage diseases etc the clinical aspects of lipids are uh, these types of uh, these diseases are associated with, associated with the abnormal chemistry or metabolism of lipids the diseases are obesity atherosclerosis diabetes mellitus hyperlipoproteinemia fatty liver 
lipid storage diseases etc so we'll discuss about the biomedical important of fats now the uh, the high concentration of polyunsaturated fatty acids in the lipids of gonads are important in reproductive functions number two they are the best reserve of food material in the human body fat are the um, fat are the main uh, material in the human body main food best reserve for of food material in the body they provide the shape and contour of the body these are fats uh, lipids act as a metabolic regulators they act as an insulator for the loss of body weight they act as the padding materials for protecting the internal body organs number five the deficiency of essential fatty acids causes skin lesions abnormal pregnancy and lactation in adults female fatty liver and kidney damages also occurs now the physiological role of fats uh, in the body fat serve as an essential source of energy when stored in an adipose tissue the, the fat soluble vitamins and the essential fatty acids are found in the fat of natural foods number three it serves as an insulating material as the subcutaneous tissue and around certain organs lipoprotein and glyco glycolipids are essential for maintaining the cellular integrity it provides building blocks for different high molecular weight substances like acetic uh, acidant can be used for the synthesis of cholesterol and certain hormones they produce meta metabolites through oxidation in the tissue which are used in the inter as uh, conversion of substances